Yeah. Hi, people of the internet who found my stupid channel. But anyway, but anyways, in this video, I am going to show you how to XP farm in Project Pokemon. So what you want to do is you want to go to Saffron City, right? To a load. That's what you want to do is you want to walk over here. Then you want to put a guy's in name in, in all capitals I S O, right? Then you press enter. It's loading its data. And ISO is a robot, and you'll see why you can XP farm. So right now I'm training my shh. I just maxed out this Mewtwo in like, I don't know, maybe an hour. Then look, I'm just gonna put that shiny Mewtwo up first. And if you battle ISO, you'll see, you'll see why he is special and why you can gain tons of XP off of him. All he has is six Audinos, so, right? So what you do is you get a Mewtwo or something, go for four Calm Minds. It's because the Audino only has Reflect, Calm Mind, Light Screen, and, and the, um... Dream Eater, yeah. So he doesn't have any attacking moves, see? He used Calm Mind and Dream Eater so far. Going and waiting for my third Calm Mind. It's going for his second Calm Mind, I guess. So if you want to do a plus six, you can. But he won't attack you at all. Yeah, see, he's went for three Calm Minds. And then you just go for the Aura Sphere, and you'll see how much how much XP he gives you. I didn't kill it because of his Calm Minds. You need four Calm Minds because on, on his last Audino, it can tank a plus three. And look how much P XP it gives you. That is quite a lot. So after this battle, my Mewtwo should be level 100, actually. Which is quite exciting. And then you just spam Aura Sphere now. Whoa, bam. One hit. Or you can go for a Weavile, go for a Swords Dance, and then, and then you can go for Brick Brick if you want. But Excel Gore, yeah, yesterday it was level 14. Now it's level 71. So. You just see how much XP it gives you. It gives you a crap ton. And Orosphere kills it. And wha-bam, I'm level 99 already. And I believe when you kill these Audinos, it, it EB trains you in HP. I'm pretty sure. But yeah, so this is how I farm XP in this game. And I'm pretty sure it's how a lot of people do. You might have already knew about this. But I found out about it yesterday. So don't judge. Yeah, I feel like after this battle, I'll just barely hit level 100. So yeah, all you do is you, is you just spam Aura Sphere. Kill his Audinos. Then I'm not level 100 yet. Oh, I guess I am, eh? Yeah, so Mewtwo is level 100. It gives you a lot of XP. Greninja's 9.99, wow. Greninja's my last Pokemon, I believe. I just got a max out. Ooh, at Route 6, I might go grab one, but I'm too lazy. 
then, yeah. So that is how you farm XP in Pokemon, no, in Project Pokemon. Then, well, bam. I'll show you how much levels my team has gotten. So this Shiny Mewtwo is level 100. The Dragonite is level 100. The other Mewtwo is level 100. The Wii file is level 100. The Greninja is 99 and the Exelgore is 73. Water Shuriken is a special move in this game. Okay, it's a special move and that's good. Okay. But thank you all for watching and I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next video if I even upload anymore. Bye.